guys, welcome to Vet Ranch. I'm Dr. Carrie. Thanks for coming to hang out with us today. Uh, this is Kiki, Squeaky's over here. And if you don't know who these two kids are, you definitely need to check out a couple playlists that I'll post. Um, and they will get you up to speed with the patients that we have. And you get to see other fun cases. Oh, it's tired other fun cases from start to finish. So definitely check those out. And if it's your first time joining us, welcome. I hope you like this format. It's more of a vlog approach and really just keeps you up to date on cases. And you're kind of going through the cases with us like we do on a normal day instead of kind of watching the case from start to finish. So I hope you enjoy. We got some pretty cool little animals in over the weekend. The shelter has been full constantly. Um, I have one that's a little, we call them alligators, a little Malinois puppy. Um, his, I named him Chade or Shade Fall Star. If you know what that's from, bonus points. Comment if you know what that name is from. One of my favorite, favorite book series. And we're gonna grab a couple little puppies that are you're gonna freak out at these puppies. But let's just jump right in, go meet Shade, and then go and get our puppies. Let's go. All right, we got this girl in. She's from the Mesquite Shelter, and the rescue that asked us to help out was Border Collie Rescue, and they are awesome. No, no. She had a cone on, now she doesn't, so she's licking at this wound. She's not using this front right leg, and then has a draining kind of open wound on this leg as well. So if we started antibiotics and pain meds, we are going to sedate her now. Um, she's still my sweet. I'm gonna sedate her now, clip and clean that, and then try to figure out why she's not using it. Cause I don't know if it would just be that laceration that would cause like no usage whatsoever. Look at those ears. I know, you don't want to shake, I know. All right, let's do it. Found this accidentally, not accidentally, I felt it and I was messing with it and then it was like, oh no, I just pulled off the head. So we're gonna scrub that as well. Glad whatever it was didn't get your eyeball. All right, here's the best view of Cakester's issue. This is her um, wound that you can see here on the right leg. This is a normal shoulder. And then look at this shoulder, it is subluxated. See how it's open there? And it's definitely kind of off of the articular surface. So that's definitely what's going on with her. We are gonna need to um, order a splint, not a splint, but a certain type of wrap to keep her in, to keep that arm drawn up and hope that it kind of fibroses in and then becomes more stable. If not, we're gonna have to look into some really complicated surgery. So hopefully that works. So it goes okay. in that direction. Okay, so okay, here, here, here. It's like the lateral ligament. I bet got hit. This is a problem. Shouldn't be doing that. So let's see what Dr. Reed says. Luckily, she's on her way. She better be wearing cool shoes today. Does that you think that means with the leg up, 
Yeah, it says as it will be positioned in the sling. Oh, I thought it said in place. Yeah, it says measure around the body and leg with injured limb in place as it would be positioned oh, in the sling. Oh, cool. 75 centimeters. decided she was over it with having a bandage on and she chewed it off and ate it this weekend. Her paw is still a little bit red, but it's healing up from the splint and the bandaging. So we're gonna take x-rays today. I think we're gonna take the cone off. We're not gonna let her go full throttle because her full throttle is crazy pants, but hopefully we can start getting back to puppiness. Right? Oh my goodness. Baby girl. So has zero fat on her body. None. I wish that was me. <laughs> Looking pretty good. It's filling in. So we can stay, have leave the uh, cast off for now or the splint and then just take it slow. Papa's running. Look at her using that. Papa's a running. Slow it down, sister. I got one speed. It's turbo. Look at you! Wow! So this is our new rescue. His name was Rick. We're changing his name to Shade. And he was given to the shelter because essentially a family got him, didn't research the breed, and he was starting to nip badly and show aggression to um, male house members. So they gave him to the shelter and we ran in and grabbed him because we want to work with a trainer and make sure that he gets into the right home. So this isn't a dog that becomes a weapon and also a dog that bounces from home to home because of his behavior issues, which everything's fixable, right? Most things are fixable. Come here, Jay, Jay. But he's super cute. He's super cute, a little bit shy. You get some treats. We'll see if he knows some tricks. Okay. Yes. Look, he's this way. Show how sweet you are. Sit. Okay. Come here. Sit. Yes. Sit. Have a paw. Can you shake? Can you shake? He knows how to shake. He see does. One up. Shake. Come here. You need to play with some other. 
another puppy. Yes, you do. You need to dog out a little bit, huh? Well, we sedated our Border Collie friend, which we're calling Clifton now. It was quite an ordeal. We gave him oral sedation this morning and then gave him an injection after that because he's the sweetest dog, but he's so untrusting with restraint, probably because he's never had that before. Um, so now he's sedated. We're gonna go ahead and neuter him while he's out and try to do everything so we can start to gain his trust after this. so that I can get everyone snacks. <laughs> but first I'll head to Wendy's office and see what she's got going. For real. He's gonna go through her lunch. He's like, oh, let me go with the snacks. Here's your weight loss is keto chip. Oh, no. He's like, weight loss is for the dogs. <gasps> He's going Somebody for a treat. Somebody a real treat. He's going with his diet. I mean, if he doesn't want Do before, before. <laughs> after. Daisy's day. Gonna get your leg fixed. Sweet little girl. It's okay. Everybody else is away from surgery. Can you hear that? Stressful. She looks like she's in an aquarium. Oh, oh it's me. Oh. Sorry. She's like, I knew I hated y'all. I knew it. I knew it. Oh. Her pre meds made her a little woozy. <laughs>
just extubated her. She's gonna be pretty out of it for the rest of the night. Hi, baby. How are you doing after your surgery? Say ouchie. It's okay. Next morning, we're on our way to recovery, Daisy. It's gonna get better. Here's Daisy's before surgery, and then this is the best one to show you. Um, the surgery that was just done. These are her post-op x-rays. So here's her plate here and then her little broken radius and ulna. So now we just have a couple weeks, probably four weeks in a splint and then we'll retake x-rays. That's a cute girl, eh? No, please don't say it. That's a cute girl, eh? <laughs> Subtitles. That's a cute girl, eh? That is a cute girl right there. That's a cute girl, eh? Oh my god. Oh, you're like the swamp people for the alligator hunters. <laughs> Who likes it? Harper? The dogs. All the animals. She gonna jump it. Ah, no. So I gonna jump it. Tell Waggle? Did you tell Waggle? Oh. Is it a sliver? It's so gentle, thank you. Oh, you why she doesn't want to eat her dog food. Oh my gosh, you just made Wendy's noise. It's rubbed off on you. Do it again. No. <laughs> you see? She does it. I do. Are you okay? You just choke on your back. <laughs> speak an Irish accent. And they're all Irish because St. Patty's Day is coming right up. He's ready to go home. That's all I've got. Beautiful girl. Crikey. She's a charmer. She's a downright charmer. I have to stop. Her face. Did you just say crikey? <laughs> yeah. They're going to another place. I know. Okay. Um, She's Steve Irwin. Can't hold her dog no. off for long enough. Scale kind of. It's precious. 5.6 pounds of pure love. Aww. Look at that. Does he have a kiss as well on his belly? Look at my junk. A little bit. I got so Don't go cool. my junk. Aww. So cute. Well, since everybody has bashed my accent, I'll stop. He's all ready for the cheese. Got a 6.1 pound. Oh, Bannon! 6.1 pounds of love. Right here. Oh, 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 Bannon. Oh, I need a picture, sorry. Get that order here. Hold that little child. It's gonna have to be good enough. It's so good. Picture has purple things. But we stopped it, yeah. Okay. <laughs> this one's big. Oh, yeah, you've got the pretzels too. Just a little puppy pile here in my Oh, yeah. Can I see it? Oh, the dad was a crazy doodle. He would be the crazy doodle. 
Yeah. These guys are so cute. I don't want them to go to New York. All of a sudden they get and they're like, oh. that's not diarrhea and we did a giardia test which was positive and this little baby just doesn't feel good this baby doesn't feel good Honey. can you please stop barking at me you're ruining our video she's like you're not paying attention to me right now so we're gonna give some sub-q fluids start some clavamox which is an antibiotic and then um just keep close track of her like where where every day her him her Ooh, that's a dirty booty her okay. i'm gonna see if it's a boy or a girl and we can think of pasta names like fettuccine linguine <laughs> this is a boy definite diarrhea too um what do you want his name to be fettuccine 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 is a boy Brown tabby, boy, no diarrhea on his bum. 1.4, big papa. What do you want this one to be? Linguini. Yeah. Boy, 0.94. Ah. Name. Boy. Oh, what's his name gonna be? Linguini fettuccine. Lasagna. Yeah, lasagna. Let me think about that one. I don't even look up noodle names. Penne, P E N N E. And then this black one is also a boy. Hi. Says you're a good mom. He's a good mama cat. We'll take care of your babies. They're a little dehydrated. You're doing a good job, though. mom because she gets really stressed anytime any dogs walk by but whoa that's like a little bear <laughs> it's real cute i like that their eyes are open why do they have like chine chine oh, chows hi mama sweet girl can i see what your puppies are doing hi opal oh my goodness Oh my goodness. Good job, Mama. Okay, good job, Opal. You did good. Okay, we're here with Tag. It's about two weeks post amputation, and it looks really, really good. Uh, we're so happy that uh, we removed that leg. Clearly, it was the right decision, and he's just doing great at his foster forever home. So we're super happy about that. So we're gonna remove these staples and he'll be good to go. I'm sorry. All right, okay, you survived it. Hello, my baby. Oh my goodness. So big news is that the rescuers that have been visiting the property trying to catch the moms found more of these puppies living under a shed, but they are a lot harder to catch. So it kind of breaks my heart because I see how happy these little spoiled babies are and they want to get the other ones so bad. Yeah. Yes. We'll try to get your brothers and sisters. We're working on it. You guys are so precious, looking so much better. Kitty puppies. Look how much these puppies have changed on their next set of vaccines. I need a side by side because remember this giant belly? Ooh, not super huge anymore. This is Seagrid, I believe. 784, Seagrid. Second vaccines. Oh, Seagrid. 12.1. Goodness, it's growing up. Look. Look. 
783, this is Helga. Oh, goodies. Look at that treat I have for you. 10.2. Do you need help? I don't think so. Olga's the sweetest one. Olga, look. He's so cute. The sweetest girl. Oh. That's not so bad. I got cheese. 4.1. Okay. Oh my goodness. She needs more. She needs more cheese. Oh. Are done? Is that good? Oh my goodness. I'll let you know when I'm done. Or do I keep doing? I just love it. We're here with B Bop, B and Bop. And uh, of course, there are beautiful bottle babies. I am partial to them. Um, Bop here actually has an adoption application. So we're going to neuter these guys today. And hopefully, he'll go home soon with his forever home. So I'm excited about that. I can't believe it. These guys were like this little and we used to bottle feed them and Carrie would make me wipe their butts and they would poop and pee and it just grossed me out. I don't know how she does it all the time, but here we are. Here we and are. so hopefully they'll have their forever home soon. Okay. I'll be here holding them until <laughs> And Bob are awake. Y'all did good. What happened to you? Huh? What? Ha oh, hi. What happened? Been mean. Baby. A sleepy. Tired. Ugh. So cute. Guys, we are wrapping up another week here at Vet Ranch. It's it's been a while. I know we always have cute puppies and I say this every time, but I cannot believe how many cute puppies we have right now. Because of that, we have a lot of adoptions. Hopefully this weekend, we have some meet and greets to do. Um, come here, Kiki. Come here. Yeah. But thank you guys so much for watching our videos. Thanks for joining us and taking this journey with us. Definitely, if you're a patron or you donate to a pet project, you are the reason that we can do what we love to do. So when you see these animals in videos, just know that you guys are giving us the ability to do what we love and to save these animals. So thank you guys so much. Consider subscribing and turning on all your notifications and I'll see you guys next week. Bye. I don't know why I did the, the jazz hands, but bye. Kiki, come here. Kiki is just kind of too good for me today. Kiki. Come here. Where did those ears come from? <laughs>